Today on Live at 4, a fiery crash on I-94 in Racine County left one person dead. Now police are still working to identify the victim. A car collided with a piece of construction equipment in a work zone. This is just south of County K. Pete Zervak is joining us live with the latest on the investigation. Pete. Well, Shannon and Steve, as you can see, all lanes of I-94 are now back open here in Racine County after that crash gridlock traffic in this area for several hours. Check out these photos showing the aftermath of a crash between a car and an excavator on I-94. Never saw nothing like that before. It happened just before 9.30 this morning. One witness reported that a tire may have come off that vehicle, causing the vehicle to swerve and, and crash into an excavator. Uh, the vehicle immediately caught fire. The driver left burned beyond recognition. We don't know if it's a man or a woman. Uh, we believe the vehicle is from the state of Illinois. The excavator was empty. No construction workers were in the area. The crash left the southbound lanes of 94 from County K to Highway 20 totally closed for more than three hours. I was backed up very far, so I think everyone's just anxious to get going. Northbound traffic in the area was also slow and temporarily cut down to one lane. Eventually, the vehicle involved was covered up and towed away. So as investigators start that process of trying to identify the victim, they say the first step is tracking down whoever owns that vehicle, which again, they believe is from Illinois, then going from there. Live in Racine County, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4. All right, Pete, thank you.